Hello everyone. I'd like to walk you through some formatting tips that I've used in the past to transform dashboards that have this regular white background view to a black background view. So I'll quickly walk through some of the steps that you'll take to get there. Step number one is you can go to format, click on workbook and change all of the fonts to white. The reason is white font definitely looks better on a black background than probably any other font, but definitely better than the black font would. So right now you can, it looks like all the fonts disappeared. Don't worry, we're gonna get them back. We can uh, format one at a time and just quickly go through the default dashboard and make that black. We can go ahead and format the worksheets and using this filler shading uh, icon, just color the entire worksheet black. You can color this worksheet black. Basically just click into every single one and change it to black. Alternatively, if you wanted to make it a different color, obviously just click through and make it a different color. Okay, you've successfully made the dashboard black at all except for this map view. And the reason is, let's go into the worksheet. Maps are a little bit interesting that way. We can go into map layers and actually change the style of the background. Instead of light, we're gonna change it to dark and that actually makes it black. Another tip I have on maps is instead of having these black borders, change the color of them to white or you know even light gray would work really well here and we can go back to our dashboard and see how that's starting to really look better we can um, drag this out a little further just to kind of even things out and in the pie chart let's also add the white borders we can format the percentages to not have those two decimal points so that's that's another small tip. Um, it's fairly easy to do and I think it just visually cleans up the dashboard a bit. So what else can we do? We can go ahead and format, uh, we can format this dashboard, I'm sorry, this worksheet. You see these red lines, we can get rid of that. Let's see, um, this, this here, the grid lines, we can go ahead and remove the zero lines, we can click into rows and say none for grid lines and that's going to make that disappear. We can go ahead into the map view and see if we need to remove any of the pane dividers, which is those lines. Um, we can go into the columns and do the same thing as well. So you can remove those lines on the sides. So there you go. This is how you go from a white background to a black background view. Thank you for watching.